Phew! Huh? It finally stopped raining. I'm soaking wet. I sacrificed the umbrella. I sacrificed my myself for the dog beds not to get wet. Great, Sonic. That was one one hundred and fifty dollars spent on dog supplies. Oh, where do I put this in the elevator? Like it's just, uh, like it's either just that or just me. Ah. We don't fit. <clears throat> now I gotta put these dog supplies in. Is there even space? Well, I mean, not for the umbrella right here. Uh, let's see. This one is from Kate's. This dog bed, and another dog bed, wow, two dog beds, $50, two dog bowls, and yet another one. Now what do I do with this? Let me close that. $150. Great move, Sonic. I'm going to go to the bathroom. Sonic! Roma, that push was embarrassing. It's like I always need your help to get down the slide. Well, it's because you do need my help. I gotta pee. There. Oh, good morning, Sonic. <gasps> Sonic! Sonic! Where are you? Eggman must have kidnapped him! Elevator! Eggman, I know your trick! Eggman, where's Sonic? Shut up! I am sleeping! Did you have to wake me up with a jump scare? Oh, Tails, hi. I'm sorry that I, I wasn't awake. What did you need? Where Sonic was? I, I don't know. I heard he told me that that uh, he was going to buy some pet supplies. And I remember he asked for some money. Since he didn't have enough money to buy supplies, since he only has enough money to pay the rent. And step by step, paying you, you guys back the money that he spent. Uh, so uh, once I worked that as that job, and and, uh, and I knew that pet supplies were very expensive, so I gave him one hundred and fifty-two dollars, and I told him to keep the change because it's probably just going to be two dollars with with twenty-six cents, just like me. Uh, um, are pet supplies that expensive? Yes, tails. Never underestimate the price of a dog bed. Two dog beds combined are $50. Altogether are $50. Three dog bowls are $30. And two brushes. And, and two brushes. Well, two brushes. And one brush for, 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 uh, um, um, what was it for? For, for like a sponge is. Twenty dollars and seventy four cents. Yes, I bought all that stuff. It is the worst. All my money. So I gave Sonic exactly, exactly one hundred and fifty two dollars because I knew he was going to need it. And just to help him out with the rent, I gave him two extra dollars for him to keep. Uh, 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 uh and that's pretty nice of you, Eggman. You're welcome, Tails. For me being nice to Sonic. Is anybody going to respect that I didn't get enough sleep? Of course. Uh, uh, we should leave this room now. I'll go make breakfast. So, we got the music player. I'll put it here on the table. And there. Oh, 
up top. We can just all have some cookies. Well, let me just listen to the song. Turn it back up. I'm finally done using the toilet, so let's see. Let me dance with the towel. Oops. Ooh, you. Uh, maybe if I flush. Oh no, it's still there. Oh no. Let me see if I flush. Oh no. Let me see. If I open it, maybe. I flushed away my, my problems. Oh no. The water rised. Amy. What did you do? Tails? I'm going to kill you. I was dancing with the towel after peeing, and, and then, uh, 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 before flushing the toilet, I just, I just, I started dancing with the towel, and it fell inside the toilet, and now the pee is still there, and the towel won't go down, uh, and, and, the toilet is clogged, and, and the water rise. Can you please fix it? Do I look like your mate to you? I've been doing the chores for two weeks. I'm supposed to do it. I'm supposed to do it one week. Look, we take turns. One week it's me, then another week it's you, then another week it's Sonic, and then another week it's Usagi, and then another week it's SSM, and then another week it's Goku. But what about Eggman? He should do the chores all the time. Eggman is a guest, uh, which, which, is, uh, which is a guest that is moving in with us. But it's still a guest. It's a roommate. Well, it's still a guest, so deal with it. It's your turn to do the chores. No, it's your turn. Your turn, your turn, your turn. That's it, Amy. I'm calling the police. 911, what's your emergency? It's an emergency. Come right now. Yes, sir. What's the address? 219 Sonic Moon Avenue. Okay, sir. We will be there in two minutes. Uh, um... Wee 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 You are a psychopath, Tails. You called the police just because I wouldn't unclog the toilet, just because the, the towel fell in, just because you were dancing with the towel after peeing in the bathroom. One, who dances with a towel? Two, it's not your, it's not my job to unclog what you clogged. And three, this is not an emergency. We can just call the plumber. But no, you have to call the police. Sir, were you the one who called? Yes. What happened? The towel accidentally fell in the toilet. And Amy refuses to unclog it for me. She needs to unclog it. Um, uh, um, I don't think that's an emergency, sir. Let me explain this correctly. I've been cleaning the house and doing the chores for two weeks. And the schedule is that each person in this house does the chores for one week. I've been doing the chores for two weeks. And after my week, is supposed to go tails. But I've been for two weeks. And then after peeing, before flushing the toilet, he has to start dancing with the towel. And he drops the towel in the toilet. And he closes the lid and flushes, thinking he can flush away his problems that easily. But no, the water just rises. And now he wants me to unclog the toilet. Would you like me to contact a plumber? Yes, very much. Uh, okay, I'll, uh, uh, I'm working on it. Hi, I am a plumber, and I'm here to unclog your toilet. This is a serious case of a towel. Um, so we're gonna get that towel out of here. Okay, so we got it. So now we want to keep <clears throat> until the water is normal again. There, now you have to pay me $20. Thank you, now we'll take my stuff and leave. So, did the plumber help? Uh, yes. Okay, so just so you know, I'm not paying you a new towel, okay? Let me take a look around the house and see if everything's safe.
Okay, is she sleeping? Uh, okay, uh, that's a way to sleep. Why isn't this little girl at school? Um, she's not little. She's forty-five years old, but she didn't drink any milk as a kid. So, so, so she, she, she looks, she looks very tiny. No, I'm pretty sure this is a little girl. No, it's not. This is a little girl. Like you just look at her, and and she's a little girl. How old is she? I told you she's forty-five. Oh, how old is she? Yeah, she's like ten. I told you she's a little girl. No, she's not. She's forty-five. Uh, uh, uh. I'm her dad, and she's forty-five. How old are you? I'm fifteen. Excuse me, that doesn't make any sense. Oh, oh, oh! I mean, I'm one hundred and eighty-five years old. Okay. Well, I don't believe you. This is a little girl, and I'm sending her to school. It is illegal for a little child not to go to school. She is too young not to go to school. Shut up! I'm sleeping. You aren't supposed to teach that kind of language to a ten-year-old. She's forty-five. Give me her ID. She's forty-five. No need to. Uh, uh, Sonic, stop lying! And I don't have a freaking ID. What is happening? She's a little girl. I told you, little girl. Uh, uh, what's 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 five? Uh, five times four. What kind of dumb question is that? It's twenty. Well, how do you know that? I don't know. I was born smart. Well, we have to send you to school because you need education. You are ten years old. You must go to school. <gasps> no, I'm forty-five. Uh, uh, and I、uh, and I don't have an ID. You are going to school. Let me get you ready. Well, I'm almost late. You are just on time. Well, you're kind of early. Hey, why is everybody staring at me like that? Stop it! It's just weird. I don't know why you're staring at me. I look so gross. Ugh! The cop dressed me up, and I look how he is. Look at how I look. I'm so disgusted looking. Nobody will notice if I just put the the girly layers in the locker. All right, let me take off the skirt. <sighs> Sorry, I'm late. Uh, uh, uh. I'll sit down right now. Um, it's okay, Elnia. Just try bringing two shoes that match next time. Well, my shoes don't match. They match perfectly. They're the same shoes. Well, next time, can you please take some more time to realize what you're putting on? I look great. I apologize for the messy hair, though.、Uh, I didn't get time to comb. Well, good morning, students. And today we have a new student joining our class. Come up here, Samantha. Oh, where's the Samantha? She's not getting up. Raise your hand if your name is Samantha. There's no Samanthas. Then where's the student? Oh yeah, another nerd. I noticed this yellow girl sitting next to me. Isn't I haven't seen her before. Well, get up and tell us your name. Hi. I rechecked, and your name was Samantha S M. Can you tell us what your last name S M stands for? Uh, my name isn't Samantha, and S M is not my last name. Then what's your name and last name? Like, what would it be? Sam? No, that's a boy's name. You have to be a Samantha or a Stephanie or something. I'm S S M. That's my first name, and my last name is Michelle. Uh, um, well, I'm guessing the first. Letter in S S M that is S stands for Samantha, and can you tell us the other two letters? No, it's just S S M. My real name is Supersonic Moon Michelle. Uh, uh, what's that name? That name is not a name. I told you, lady, I'm Supersonic Moon, and you're just going to have to deal with it. I'm calling you Samantha because I know that's your name. Recheck. It's S S M. Click on the full name thing, and、uh, it'll say Supersonic Moon Michelle. I'm pretty sure your name's Samantha. Lady, my name is Supersonic Moon. <sighs> you can call me Michelle. All right. Nice to meet you, Michelle. Michelle, you can now grab a lollipop. Thanks, I guess. 
Uh, Michelle, that's a boy's color. Uh, get the pink. I don't want the freaking pink, and I don't feel like fighting over this gender-labeled color thing. I want the blue, so I am going to eat the blue. Got it, lady? You can't talk like that to your teacher. <sighs> since it's the first day of your... Since it's your first day, you don't have to go to detention. <sighs> You have two more chances. Okay, lady, I'll just enjoy my lollipop. Today, we will be learning about fractions. <laughs> Excuse me, are you guys listening? Mrs. Velvet, Mrs. Velvet. Uh-uh, no thank you, Leia. We don't talk without raising our hands. Well, before being called on, we don't talk. But everybody keeps turning to me and laughing. Just if you're confused, quick introduction. SSM first day in school hates being there. Elnia, always late kid with, with, un, with the shoes that don't match every single day. Random outfit, messy fat pigtails every day. Shingo, Usagi's brother. Alicia, confident spoiled kid with four rubber bands for her pigtail. And then finally, Leia. She used to be blonde, but now he di she dyed her hair blue, and she has no clue that she is a smurf now. So everybody laughs, and she does not know why, because she does not know that she is a smurf. And this is Miss Velvet. Back to the video. <sighs> Leia, for how long did you not know look in the mirror? Like five days, why? Well, you dyed her your hair blue, see? Yeah, I did. How does it look? I know there's some blonde left, but I, I like it. Well, I think you dyed your face, too. Oh, no. I'll bring you a uh, mirror from Mrs. Joe's class. Here's the mirror. <gasps> I'm a Smurf! Meanwhile, Spawn Sonic, why did you spend $150 on this? pet supplies because the pandemic got way worse so i can't go to that place to work so i'm gonna start working from home uh they bring the pets and and i have to take care of them oh okay i should be getting the pets anytime now that must be the pet hi welcome to sonic pet place I'm Sonic the Hedgehog, and I will be taking the pet. Yeah, this is my house. I don't live with lots of people. I, I have tested. I don't have COVID. So, yeah, just give me your pet and pay me. Here are my two cats, Whisker and Whisker Zia. Make sure to give them lots and lots of kisses and attention. They cannot live without affection. This is Whisker and Whisker Zia. Can I trust you? Can you pay me? Here's 20 bucks for three hours. Um, I get paid 10 an hour. Uh, wait, can you make that four hours? Because uh, I, I have a meeting after this and it's, it's just better so that I can also go to the mall and shop with my friends. Will you pay me? Uh, yes. Can I trust you? Can you pay me? Here is another $20 bill. Have fun with my little whiskey and whiskers. Zia! Oh, my little kittens. Go. Bye. Okay, so I don't get paid for this. Can you please just leave my house? Ah, fine. I got cats. Ugh, I think I'm awake enough now. 
So do you want me to help? Uh, yeah. Will you give me half the money? Fine. Well, these are the cats, Whisker and Whiskerzia. So here are all the supplies I bought. Uh, do we comb them? Sure. <gasps> Whiskerzia! Nobody will notice, right? Let's just leave her on the floor. Rest in peace, Whiskerzia. We'll leave you in peace, don't worry. They say flush away our, your problems. We say hide them. Can I sleep? Yes, robot. And Whisker's kind of cute. I gotta say. Let's put him in the bed. Sonic, I think that's a dog bed. I think she's enjoying it. How do you know if it's a girl? I just guess. I guess there's no running away from Whisker's ear. Let's put you in the bed. Uh, uh, I'm scared of the cat. What's wrong with it? That's a dog bed. Okay, what's a cat bed? Uh, I, I'll go. I'll go search on Amazon a cat bed. And the only thing that pops up is dog bed. So I already have one. Go to sleep. I just want to relax. So that they're both asleep. I hope. I don't think so, Sonic. Their eyes are wide open. Look at that. Shut up, narrator. I'm just going to keep an eye on the cats. <laughs> Meanwhile, who can tell me what one hole is equal to? I'm bored. I have an idea. Aha. Uh -huh. I'm just going to mute the phone. No, 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 no. Dang, notifications. I forgot to mute them. Michelle Samantha, what are you doing? I'm multiplying two by six. One, that's cheating, and two, we're not working on multiplication, we're working on fractions. Were you paying attention? What is one whole divided into two pieces? Two halves. What is half of that whole divided into two pieces? One half. Yes. Were you paying attention? Yes. Is that your phone? No. Samantha, please stop lying to me. Why did you bring that phone to school? Make up an excuse. Make up an excuse. So my uh, uh, um, my brother, Sonic the Hedgehog, which lives with me, uh, um, um, uh, uh, has a pet sitting business, and he and he told me to bring my phone because he might text me for help. And I brought my phone, and he just texted me. Well, your brother shouldn't tell you to bring such a thing to school. He's my older brother. He's like, he's like, he's like 35. <sighs> okay, SSM. You can leave it fit for your brother. Uh, and I won't mark you absent because <sighs> you needed it. Sugar crush. Oh, crap. I forgot to turn all, to turn my, my volume off. What was that? You're playing Candy Crush Saga to the principal's office now. So, you brought your phone to school. Yes, I did. And lied to your teacher that it was for your big brother. Now, tell me the truth. Is he your big brother? No, he's my roommate. Just so you don't confuse, so you don't get confused. I'm a mix of Sonic, Sailor Moon, well, Usagi, uh, Goku, Sky, Miles, and Mar. So, yeah, uh, um, I have a lot, a lot of roommates. Why would you lie like that to your own teacher? We could call your parents. I don't have parents. I have roommates. If you call my oldest roommate Eggman, he won't do anything about it. He doesn't know why people get so freaked out that I take my phone to school. Because he agrees, it's boring. Detention!
but I'm already in detention. You'll be sent to school. You'll be sent back home now. 911, what's your emergency? Hello, my friend Sonic the Hedgehog got scratched in the eyeball by a cat and it got infected uh, by cat saliva. And we need uh, an ambulance stat. We'll be there in two minutes. He's going to die in two minutes. We'll make it as fast as possible. You okay, Sonic? Let me remove the cat. One hour and 45 minutes later. I mean, it's not that bad. All right, it's pretty bad. I am never babysitting cats again. For a yeet under my bed. Okay, Bo, where's my other cat? Let me tell you a simple little story. Your cat, just because I put it on a dog bed, because I didn't have anything else to put it on, jumped on me and scratched me in the eye and it got infected by cat saliva because uh, she started licking it and scratching it at the same time. Then we had to go to the hospital. I got this ugly eye patch and Roma yeeted it Yeeted your cat under her bed. You're welcome. <laughs> Whisker, Whisker, uh, Whisker, see ya. Nailed it. Everything by Sonic Moon. Kawaii Pizza Industries. Everything by Sonic Moon. Zermay doesn't fit in her bed productions. And bye.